So if we are going for the IVF procedure, we would like to see at least 15 million sperm per mil uh, in order to decide, uh, and of course, other factors uh, beside the count on, on mat uh, also matter. For example, if we have 15 million sperm, but we have a lot of dead sperm or abnormal sperm, this can impact our decision. So it's a collection of different parameters uh, that are seen in the sperm that makes an embryologist to decide whether to proceed with an IVF procedure or whether to then change it to what we call ICSI or microinjection. For ICSI, it has revolutionized uh, our treatment in the lab for, for the uh, infertility couple, infertile couples. The reason is for every egg, we just need one good sperm to, to be found where the embryologist can pick it up and inject the egg with it and hopefully get fertilization and good quality embryo.